Hi everyone, I'm Laurie Powell and I'm Indy's mum. My daughter Indy is uh, someone who when she makes her mind up achieves whatever she sets her mind to. Indy is a kind, resilient and willful child. Uh, she has a really funny sense of humour. Crown me. <laughs> Beautiful. It's my throne now. Welcome to my crib. Oh, let me show you around. <laughs> she will do anything to help somebody else out, even at her own expense. She's a really good kid and she has a lot of people that look out for her. Hi, I'm Indigo Powell and I am the 4,500th wish. <laughs> Having your child being granted a Make-A-Wish is both the most heartbreaking and thrilling thing at the same time because you never, ever expect your kid to be the one who's been given a wish but so incredibly grateful that they give this light to the children who they're able to grant wishes to. My wish is to give back to the children at UNC Chapel Hill Children's Hospital. I want to give them some support and comfort. I wanted to be that person to give them the things that brought me so much joy when I was there. A few years ago, Indy started complaining of some headaches and um, she's not a complainer, so we knew there was something really wrong. And we took her to see Dr. Walker, who's her pediatrician and has known her since she was teeny tiny. Immediately sent her for an MRI and was at our house by the time we drove back from the MRI with, with the news. They said that she had um, a tumor the size of an orange. We knew that her diagnosis was one of the most serious kinds of brain cancer you can have. Within five hours she had her admitted to UNC and had a bed for her and marched us straight off to the hospital. Her first brain surgery lasted 10 hours, a couple of rounds of chemotherapy, 38 sessions of radiotherapy in a row, four sessions of T-cell removal training and, and then being put back in her. She had to have a second brain surgery. Getting in that car every day to drive to UNC was traumatic. Not once did Indy say that she couldn't do it. I had to just keep fighting. There was no really other choice. I don't know how I got through it and I wouldn't be able to tell you how I went through the last three years. You just do because you have to. Always look for the light because no matter what hard time they're going through, there's always something good that's going to come. Walking in here and seeing everything put together is just amazing. It just makes me feel so loved by other people to know that they want to do this and help me make this come true. From the amount of joy I feel now, knowing that 4,500 other kids have felt this way too, is just amazing. It just, this really truly is something that has me so excited and just I've not been able to sleep, I've been so excited. I have not seen Indy so thrilled about anything in her life. And she's a very passionate kid. I'm giving, but I'm also taking the joy for myself of being able to do this and help others and put smiles on people's faces, but also being able to give that love and support that other kids may need. Special bag. Perfect okay. amount of stickers. I can't believe how many toys there are out there. I think you'll be stocking UNC up for the next five years and I don't even know how the Make-A-Wish people were able to get into the office every morning with all the boxes. <gasps> They're so cute! <laughs> this indigo bunny brought me so much comfort and joy when I was here. Hope you know that you're loved. Always let your light glow. Exotic Car Club has helped us out with donating a bunch of toys, 270 to be exact. I get to see super cool cars and I get to do this wish, so I'm so excited. Welcome to my old stomping grounds. This one was mine. I think that it might be a very emotional day for me tomorrow. 
seeing those kids where I was and having those memories come back of the dark places I was at. If I would have given up fighting, I wouldn't be here today to be able to fulfill my dream of doing this. I'm just so excited to stand by the side and, and watch the joy in their face. Might be a few tears, but we'll see how that goes. We're about to go deliver bunnies and invitations to all the kids on 5C floor and invite them to come to my shop and pick out as many toys as they want. What this room for me is most associated with is sitting down with families around a table and sharing new diagnoses. A lot of tears are shed around the table that usually sits right here in the middle of this room. So to see this room repurposed with the toys and see the kids coming in here and see them smiling, it's so awesome. Big things like this are just so exciting and add so much energy to both the teams, their families, the patients, everybody. This is amazing. Today was my Make-A-Wish day and I had the best day of my entire life. Knowing that there's so much love and support in the world just makes my heart so happy. It feels like we raised the best kid in the world. <laughs>